Hi friends! Welcome back to my channel. As the title says, August was a very eventful one for me. I started a new job, which I will talk more about in this video. Kevin got called to the bar, which means he's officially a lawyer right now. And so his family was here in town during that period of time and we traveled a bit. And I also got invited to speak in like my first speaking gig this month, which was pretty fun. So this vlog, I'd say, is the most fun one so far so be sure to just sit back relax and enjoy this vlog Digital Boss Babes event today. So it's actually like my first time doing an in-person speaking training workshop thingy. Um, and as expected, <laughs> I really do enjoy it. I've always thought like it's something that suits my personality because I'm an extrovert and I do get energy from people. And while I was I was quite nervous before that and while I was on top, I didn't even realize how energetic I got. Apparently that was like the feedback from many people and they love it. So that's good. I hope that there's gonna be more of this to come now. I really enjoyed it. Hi Kevin. Oh. Mm. Are you proud of me? Yes. We are going for this um, Get Asli charity dinner that uh, his boss got tickets. So we're just gonna go and have free food. <laughs> I'm quite excited for this. Yeah. yeah, I wonder what kind of food they Me too. Hmm. Also, I love that yellow suit that I have. I'm thinking that that could be like my signature colour right now. I know, like just only, I would be that girl with only yellow colour suits. So I have like yellow check, I, I really want to find a yellow checkered ones. Like the one in the, the movie Clueless, that girl has a very cute checkered suit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start looking for that on Taobao. <laughs> <laughs> Yes! Dinner free food! Here we go! And that is because I got an eye infection, which explains why I'm not having any what makeup. Sharingan. Hey, I'm not Naruto. Not Naruto, it's Sasuke. What's that? It's I don't know. Person. He keeps saying I'm a anime character. But anyways, yes, I got an eye infection, which explains why I have no makeup on right now. Which, ex which explains why I have no makeup right now. This eye, it's no longer red but it's still very itchy and uncomfortable so I, d I don't know how long it's gonna take for it to get better but it is a uh, Saturday today and we are heading out to meet up with his friends <laughs> interesting group of friends actually so we're actually meeting up with a group of people that he plays game with you haven't met most of them right? yeah yeah so I'm going to be in a geek gathering but I got my iPad and my phone. No I can read and do my own stuff there. I'm just, I'm just going for the food. I'm very hungry. I want fries. Fried lunch and meat would sound nice. I love lunch and meat. Oh. Ordered dah makan for the first time 
and we receive our puzzle. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got the Sichuan noodles. So this Sichuan noodle pack is a heatable one, so it comes with the dish on top, and then and the soup, the soup underneath here. Now it looks good. Yes. I hope it tastes good. That's my pumpkin lasagna. It looks good too. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. It's a Monday morning and it's actually a public holiday here too. I know there's a lot of public holiday here. So right now I'm actually heading out to see if the hair salon is open. I've been getting a lot of tangles at the bottom of my hair. I also feel like I deserve like a good wash and blow to pamper myself. Because having this eye infection and not being able to put on full on makeup, it really makes me feel very shitty. Um, and I've been feeling shitty for the past weekend and I feel like I deserve this. Fingers crossed that the salon is open. That's how the final haircut looks like. I like the length. I like how he curled here, but I really don't like how he curled my fringe. I just feel like it's so out of place. It's not how I usually do it. I like it out of my forehead, but it's okay. At least I have a nice blowout. I'm pretty sure you could see from just now how much I enjoyed the hair wash. I really need to do this more often, man. I need to start pampering myself even more. It feels so good. And guess what? Kevin is still not awake yet. Let's go wake him up. Baby. Mm. Wake up. Mm. <laughs> mm, potato. Mm. 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 Are picky or not? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I go hair cut. <laughs> Finally, got to try my friend's shop, Meijo. It's a strawberry fruity cheese cap. It's so good. It has the real strawberry inside. But you like your your grape more, right? Mm. It's so good.
What is up everyone? I know I look really messy. Messy hair, greasy face, but who cares, right? It's it's already 7 and I've had a long day busy with work stuff and I just got home to this new parcel. The parcel looks really nice so I thought I should record this. Um, I have been using a notebook that I got from Taobao for a while now and I've been partially doing bullet journal. So like I kind of like I don't have everything like super pretty washi tapes and all that stuff but um, I do put in a little bit of effort to organize my notes and all that and I find that the creative side of things it is really therapeutic of me and so I decided to invest on a prettier fancier expensive bullet journal um, I got this from Summary which is a Malaysian local brand I found them when I was shopping at Rio in the city a while back and at that time I wasn't super into bullet journal yet and it's a little bit on a pricier side but it does come with a really pretty um, packaging so let's see right um, it's a kind of like a you know a fancy slot out box and upon opening it has these stickers that says obviously you have good taste can you see that the parcel come in like triple layer bubble wrap and then inside there's another layer of bubble wrap um, so it's really nicely protected oh the box it actually has is really pretty too hmm okay anyways can't wait to open um, you can customize everything from the cover from the cloth cover the top part and the, to the bottom and to the you know the rubber band and mine says you know it's embroidered is this embroidered i don't know what's the like i have this golden name printed on it oh and it's so pretty it has these notes um it tells me what exactly i got oh, it's actually really pretty mm. this is like my first impressions i'm really impressed um paper quality is good I, that's like one of the things because i couldn't see it in person so I was worried about it, but it's good quality stuff. Ever since I started doing business, I've become a huge advocate of supporting local and I'm just really glad that I'm able to support this business because it's definitely on the pricier side, but you know, everything's nicely customized for me. So I'm happy to do this. Yes. Woohoohoo, it's later tonight and I only found out that they have a handwritten message for me. It's so sweet. I'm not even like some special guest or anything, you know, but they still took the time to write this. Sweet, sweet, yeah. Heavy. <laughs> Finally got caught to the bar. Yay! Yay! It's a caught, yeah. Dun -dun -dun. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Oh. So there's something that actually been happening for a while in August now and I feel like it's time for me to like sit down and explain to you guys about everything. So you can see that I'm wearing a t-shirt that says Vintan Crew. Basically this month I started a new job um, as a GM in a, I would say like it's a masterclass events company. Basically my boss Vince Tan, he is a local entrepreneur and you know, things just happened, you know, really quickly, unplanned. I wasn't really looking for a job, but, you know, fate brought us together. So what happened today is, today's actually like the first day of like one of the bigger workshops that we organized. And it's also the same day as Kevin's long call. So like the past week has been busy, um, like preparing for the event and yesterday we were done setting up at about maybe 1 plus a.m. and I got back shower and like maybe slept around 2 plus and I woke up at 5 plus you know to put on my makeup and get ready to be at the hotel at 6 30 and you know after like the morning preparation stuff I rushed to the court 
to celebrate my boy's big day, which I'm so proud of. Like, I actually teared up in the court. <laughs> so lame. But I think that's also because like I, I only I was like running on three hours worth of sleep. But anyway, so like I rushed to the long call, had a meal with them, and then came back to the event. And like it was my first time, you know, witnessing and also help organizing the event. And I learned a lot. I don't know if I would have time to show you guys about what goes to the event, but I'm not worried about that because there's gonna be a lot more of these events coming up in my life. Um, what I like about this job is that it's an entrepreneurial community. So I'm surrounded by people who wants to grow a business, who has ideas, and who has that this entrepreneurial mindset or like are getting into it. And you know, it's just nice to be surrounded by such people. It's 10 p.m. right now on day one. We finally got to have an earlier night today. Um, I do have some stuff, you know, to get ready for tomorrow. And I need to shower and just, um, you know, just get started with my stuff. I Right now, I'm staying in Raid Hotel. It's actually a very nice hotel, by the way. It just makes more sense for us to stay at the hotel since we'll be here like almost all day. I love this lamp by the way. It's like a geometrical bird. It's pretty cool. Um, I am at Red Hotel. Uh, at Red Hotel by Sirocco, yes. Yeah, it's a pretty sweet little room. Good thing my bosses are awesome to like actually book us this room. Um, bathroom's amazing. I mean like Simple and nice. There's nothing too fancy about it, but it's actually good. And it has a nice vanity. You know, it ha actually has a proper vanity where I can do my makeup. And there's a long mirror. And then, you know, the usual stuff. I actually got to do my work there. But yeah, I really need to get showered and start wrapping up today's work so that I can rest early. Hopefully, I can update you guys more about the events. So it's a day after like the three days event for my company. I'm physically so exhausted but I know it's like freedom time. So I decided to just book a ticket to go to Ipo where Kevin and his family are right now. So I'm just gonna join them for like the last one day of a trip and come back on Tuesday. I'm not taking this camera with me but I ho hopefully I get to like shoot a little bit of videos um, from my phone because I really want to make sure that this is just a rest chill trip and not trying to do anything because I feel like I deserve like a good rest after that three days so yeah I'm excited for rest and food
of love, how great your love. As far as east is from west, so far has sins from us. Repaying our sins with your kindness, your grace abounds. Not what our debts deserve, you came, and the reason was love. Love is patient and kind. When there's love, there's no envy, no pride. As eventful as it was, August was also pretty overwhelming for me because I started a new job and I was still trying to keep this YouTube channel alive and I'm still trying to grow my business coaching business and I'm still trying to do all the female empowerment stuff that I'm so passionate about and so there was a lot of things going on and I was like, you know, struggling to juggle between them all and you know, and it's not to say that I'm not grateful for these opportunities and everything, it's just that that's the reality of it, right? Sometimes, give or take, I have to, you know, maybe sacrifice a thing or two, which brings me to the announcement that I will not be posting any YouTube videos in the month of September besides this vlog. And that's because I want to take a couple weeks off to really re-evaluate all that I'm doing on YouTube and to really plan better content for you guys and that's because like I don't want to just post videos on YouTube because I want to be consistent of course I want to be consistent but I want to make sure that I'm also putting out quality content so I hope you guys understand that and you know in the meantime be sure to check out all these old videos that I have they've been sitting there I'm pretty sure you've missed out a couple or two so be sure to check them out before I come back here okay don't miss me too much and don't worry, I'll be back very very soon. It's just a few weeks off and I promise you I'll be back, okay? I'll see you soon. Bye!